Hello and welcome to HITC Sport. This is the Premier League review where we run down all the big events in the top flight from the past weekend. The action began at Turf Moor where Sergio Aguero's brace sped Pep Guardiola's blushes after Dean Marnie's sublime volley put Burnley ahead. Two of the Premier League's out of form sides faced off in wheels in a cliched six pointer. It was a goal fest at the Liberty Stadium which saw the Swans lead 3 1, with three goals in nine minutes put Palace back in front. The drama wasn't over, however. Fernando Llorente's double in stoppage time gave Bob Bradley his first win as Swansea boss and moved them off the bottom following Summons' loss at Anfield. Alan Pardew's side have now lost six games on the bounce. In the evening kickoff, Chelsea remained top of the Premier League, ending Tottenham's unbeaten start of the season. Victor Moyes has scored the winner for Antonio Conte's side. On to Sunday now, and Ronald Koeman's return to Southampton didn't quite go to plan. His Everton side were behind in the first minute at St Mary's when Charlie Austin headed home, assisted by Premier League debutant Josh Sims. The Saints held on for victory. Over at Old Trafford, it was another day to forget for Jose Mourinho. West Ham took the lead after two minutes through Diafra Sacco, but Zlatan Ibrahimovic drew the Red Devils level after 21 minutes. Just as things were looking up for United, referee Jonathan Moss booted Paul Pogba for a dive in the 28th minute, forcing I rate Mourinho to boot a water bottle down the touchline. The special one was immediately sent to the stands. If things couldn't get any worse for Jose, Ed Balls and Honey G were booted off strictly an X-Factor. Never mind, Jose.